Hello everyone, today I'm making masyora. It is a typical Nepali food. Masyora is generally made out of black lentil or mung beans. You can also add some vegetables to it. Since it's sun dry, masyora can last for months up to a year. Here are the ingredients to make masyora. I'm using soaked black lentils, taro roots, and spring onions. Chop the spring onions really fine. Do not use a food processor or a blender to chop the vegetables. It becomes very soupy. Transfer the chopped onion into a bowl and keep it aside. Now work on the taro roots. Peel off the taro roots. Taro roots are a bit slimy so be careful when peeling off the taro roots. Clean it. Once you've washed it, grate it. Use a large grater and then grate it. Now let's prep the black lentils. So this black lentils, it's skinned. I have soaked it overnight and now it's time to grind it. So grind it really fine and add as less water as you can to blend this because we are going to dry this uh, and we don't want excess water in it. Add the chopped vegetables, chopped green onions and grated taro roots. Mix it really well once you've mixed it using a hand or a cookie scooper. Scoop it out on trays. I'm using glass chopping board to sun dry these lentil nuggets. Make it about one inch wide nuggets and sun dry it. Since I am in Arizona, these will dry out in a day. Uh, you can uh, put it out in the sun until it's completely dry. Once it's dry, you can store it in a glass jar for months up to a year. You can cook masyura with gundruk. It blends really well with gundruk. And you can eat it with rice or rotis or even chura. I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.